Hey, this is Ashley and you guys are watching Ashley Epidemic and I'm just going to do a very quick unboxing of X1's debut album, Quantum Leap. There are two versions, B-Song and Quantum Leap. And let's just go ahead and show you. So the two parts, they together make an X here that you can see. Um, and there's a really cool butterfly effect that they have. So let's just go ahead and let's start with the B-Song version. So. Here's the B-Song version, and I'm gonna go ahead and slide it out. So, I don't know if you saw that, but let me, I'm gonna put it in so it's a little bit of a less tighter fit, and you can see how the butterfly does. So, just so you get a better look at the butterfly, now that I have the other piece out, it's a little bit easier for me to slide, and I can do it slowly. But, so here is the album, and you can see the X, which is half of the butterfly, and as you slide it, the wings flap until it comes out. Um, and that's because of the way that this is designed here. It makes it look like flapping, which is really cool, really cool butterfly effect that it has. So there are two parts. There is the photo book and then there is the packaging with the CD, which is nice because it keeps things separate. And I can look at the photo book now as a book without worrying about um, the CD or anything. So let's just go ahead and I'm going to, let's take a look at the actual photos. And these are really, really nice photos. I really like the B-Song photos out of all of them. It's just, I, I just kind of really like this softer look. They didn't go for like, a, for the most part, for most of the guys, they didn't go with like a really childish look, but they just went with a light, refreshing look for the guys. And it's really, really nice. Um, and I just really enjoyed it. Um, overall, the guys look cute and precious. Like, look at Dohyun. He looks like the precious little baby that he is, even though he's like practically six feet tall. But, and then we have a nice little Team Rocket little photo session before we get into the group, which is great. I absolutely love X1. Um, X1 are and i'm going to be bold and say this these are one of my old groups um and these they're probably second only to only one other group they are my ultimates i adore them they are precious and talented and amazing and i want nothing but the best for them in the world and i fully 100 percent intend on standing until the end um, I'm to the point where I've invested myself in many different aspects, one of them being I've started a video archive. So of all the videos that X1 releases, be it on SNS or officially and anywhere in between, variety, all that, if X1 pops up in it, as long as it's not a fan cafe post, it is fair game. And I've launched that and I'm going to maintain it for the next five years. So that is commitment because I am a I am a want it and I have no problem saying that, admitting it, enjoying it, loving it. These are my guys and I'm going to do what I can to make other want it's lives easier too. Um, but yeah. I will actually leave a link to the content archive. It is very raw right now, but I am working on it. Um, there are some cool features that I'm actually thinking about that should actually be live within the next couple of days. Um, but any suggestions people make also, I will definitely take into consideration. I really love X1 though. They're so talented. Um, I'll tell you who my bias is in a minute, but... Um, Look at that! Look how cute they are with the sparklers. Oh, they're so precious. And then we have the lyric pages in the back. And then it ends with a nice little photo there. And look, it ends with the cat. So they actually tease it in the photo book. So at the end of the MV, there were cat eyes that pop up. And there's a theory that, so last time we had the butterfly and everything, and the theory is now we have like a cat. And so next comeback is probably gonna be cat related. So here's the extra pack. This is the stuff inside. So inside you open it up and you get your standee. I'm not gonna pop this out because I don't know who's gonna end up getting this. Um, but here is a Jun Hall 
Chaginot. And um, this is, this is at first I didn't know what this was, but this is the standee base. And then you pop in and you put Jinho, then the X one, and then his name, and then there's your little standee. Um, it also comes with the photo card, so they are positioned very nicely in this. It's not quite as striking as it is in the Quantum Leap, which I will show you, but they are positioned the same way in this nice little triangle. And this is the Bisong group postcard. Um, and then you have a bookmark. And so this one is Johan, and it has the little ribbon at the top. Let's show you a little bit closer. So there's Johan. And then it has on the back X1, and then it has Kim Johan, his name, there as well. Then we have right here, and I'm going to move this out of the way in case it messes anything up. But we have Wusok here, Kim Wusok. And there's something really cool about these photo cards because these are AR photo cards, which means that, um, so I'm going to go ahead and I have the app pulled up. Let's tap to scan. And what? Look at that. And there's the photo. Looks like being cute. And so that is the B-Song version. So it is very pretty. And here is the Quantum Leap version. So let's just go ahead and let's, it's the same thing like the other one. So I'm gonna slide it out. It does its little butterfly too, as well as it flaps. And then, so here, let's take a look at this one. This is the Quantum Leap version, like I mentioned. And um, so I said I would mention who my bias is, and it's Hangul. E Hangul. I love Hangul. I love all of them, but Hangul particularly gets me, and I'm just so proud of him always. So he's the bias, but I really am truly OT11 in this case. Like, I really love them all, and I can't just narrow down fully just to one. So here we have the, these were the teaser photos that they had for the Quantum Leap version that they posted. I do like how they look more in the photo book than they did um, as teasers because you have the page division. So they do look more like just separate photos. Yes, they are mirrors, which is what they've been doing with this concept a lot right now. Um, and then there's more of the mirror. And then now we have the same units that we had in the B-Song version, except now they're in the Quantum Leap, so different outfits. Um, these guys look great. Ugh. They're truly, truly high class. High class, classy, talented, amazing, beautiful, wonderful. Stan X1, Theo won it. It's, it's good times. And then we have the lyric pages. Then you have the photo here. And then you have this group photo, which they didn't have one of those in the B song, if I remember correctly just now. And then you have, again, more of the cat motif. You have the, the walking away footsteps from the cat. And yeah, so let's look at the inner pack here. So this one we have, this is what these guys look like. So here's a Singwu, and then we have, so I quite like, this is the group, the group postcard, and I really like the symmetry and the starkness on this one. I really like this a lot. And then we have, this is what the bookmark and the photo card look like. And now let's take a look at the actual um, AR. So here's the photo card. This is a Hangul one. And so we have the moving app up, and there we go.
go. He's making a little, like a heart and a star, and just making things. And Hongil's being cute and precious. That was actually really, really long. <laughs> I think I'll post a video of the rest of the ARs once I get more from the go. But yeah, those are the albums. And yeah, I hope you enjoy enjoyed this unboxing. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.